Not like that.
Stop right there. Not a step further. Calm down. I'm not out to get you. <sighs> By Enos. I almost took you for one of those wretched orc mercenaries. Aren't you afraid the orcs might get you? Orcs are careless and noisy when they roam the woods. I can hear them half a mile away. The only plague that is getting to me is those horrible goblins. You are more afraid of goblins than of orcs? Scared? I am not scared at all. The goblins will creep around the camp at night and steal everything I've got. There must be a whole nest of those cowardly goblins somewhere close by. Tell me about the area here. You were in the wilderness here. No cities anywhere. That mountain range to the north separates the coastal region from the Midlands. Keep following the path to the west, and you'll eventually get to Montera. Provided the bandits don't cut your throat first, that is. Interested in a little trade? Depends on what you have, really. Show me your goods. I finished off those cowardly goblins. And the bastards didn't skin you alive? Oh, I'll be. You've got what it takes, my friend. This is certainly worth a hundred gold coins. Nothing more to be had there. Wait a moment. I've never seen you here. Don't tell me you slipped through the lines of the orcs. I'm just passing through. From the look of you, I would say you're up to something. You will report to Merrick, the leader of the orc mercenaries in Montera, within three days, or you're in trouble. Got it? How do I get to Montera? If you take the path up to the north, you'll get there faster. But you're sure to be attacked by bandits. The path to the west is better for you. It's longer, but not so dangerous. I see. Show me your goods.
What do you want? Should probably do it myself. Someday this will be over. When you talk to Porgen, show him some respect, or you'll deal with me. Who are you? I am a ranger and a martial arts instructor. My name is Ericus. I'm a personal guard of the druid Porgen, so think before acting. Understood? What kind of place is this? A place of destruction and despair. This valley was once the largest village of the rangers of Mertana. People came from everywhere and were restored through the healing hands of our druid Porgen. What happened here? The orcs destroyed our village and stole whatever they could find. I am only one of a few who survived the massacre. Cursed be all those who wreak havoc with the plants and creatures of Adnos. You are at war with the orcs? We rangers are a peaceful people. We make it our task to serve the druids and protect them. But those wretched orcs came to us with the blade of war unsheathed. And now we are taking back what is rightfully ours. No more, no less. I see. Where are the orcs who did this? They retreated to the big cities of Mertana. We cannot reach them there. All that is left of them is a small orc patrol to the north. They are watching us. Can you teach me your fighting style? Not before I get to know you better, stranger. How am I to know you wouldn't use your newly acquired knowledge to attack me? Let's rough up that orc patrol. There's nothing I would rather do, but I don't know whether we are strong enough. Don't fret. We can do it. All right. You seem to know what you're talking about. I am ready. Follow me. For Porgon. I don't think I want to hear this. Well, that takes care of that. Ah, you asked now! There. So much for you, filthy beast. One filthy beast less. Showed him. You better not mess with me again. Oh, 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 oh. Nothing more to be had Thanks there. Thanks for the gold, hero. I think I'll take the weapon with me. your weapon. No! I'll chop you to pieces. No! <sighs> now you're going to bleed. <clears throat> Got it.
Orcs are creatures of Adnos, just like you and me. We should respect each other, not fight. The Orc Patrol is history. Thanks for your help, stranger. Here, I want you to take this with you. May the light of Adnos lighten every path that you walk. We could also train a little more if you want. Would you teach me how to fight? Would you teach me how to fight? You aren't ready for that. Carry on. <clears throat> That's the way. There are more of the beasts. Well, that takes care of that. Adonos be with you. What can I do for you, Wanderer? I suppose you are in charge here. I am no ruler. My children, the Rangers, are with me of their own free will, Wanderer. I am a preserver of creation. We Druids are guardians of the world and its nature. We draw our power from the strength of Adonos's creatures. Can you heal me? I can, Wanderer. Come to my fire, and I shall ease your pain. Heal my wounds. Light of Adonos, illuminate this body. What creature is the source of your power? My druid stone possesses the power of the boar, but alas, my stone was stolen by the orcs, Wanderer. It is more than disturbing to know that it is in the hands of these foolish creatures.
I found your druid stone. Thank you, Wanderer. But I see that it is pale and powerless. If it is to regain its old strength, I shall have to recharge it. Can you recharge the druid stone? I can, but I am lacking ingredients for the procedure of renewal. You have returned the stone to me, Wanderer. If you help me to recharge it, I will share my power with you. I will help you in your search for the ingredients for your druid stone. Very well. I need 20 stone roots. They grow exclusively in very damp places. You will only find them near riverbeds. Good luck. Here, your stone roots. Good work, Wanderer. Now I can recharge the Druid Stone for the service you have done me. I will share my power with you. Take my Druid Stone and keep it better than I could. Teach me something about ancient magic. Teach me something about alchemy. You aren't ready for that. Good. Carry on. I want to brew mana potions. Ah, uh, mana potions. Their power develops in their effect. They are a source of pure magic power. There are various recipes for these potions. So get yourself one, find the necessary ingredients, and go for it.
for the king. You're awfully brave. What do you mean? You won't get far talking like that with the orcs occupying the area. We rebels can be recognized a mile away anyhow. You should treat us with a little more respect. Otherwise, you'll end up like the desert merchants. What desert merchants are you talking about? If you follow the road to the west, you can still see their old stuff lying around. We robbed them and drove them off. Where are these desert merchants now? <laughs> they ran all the way to Monterra. It would be better for them if they stay there. What are you doing here? I'm waiting for a message from our man in Monterra. Your man? We planted a spy in among the mercenaries. He's supposed to let us know when the right moment has come to start the revolution. Will you tell me more about your spy with the mercenaries? Just because you haven't killed me yet doesn't mean I trust you. That would be too easy. You robbed the desert merchants? Oh yes, and how. But before you get any silly ideas, we already took everything to Okara. Tell me more about Okara. You'll learn about that soon enough. Believe me. I want to join you. Then prove it. For days, one of those stupid mercenaries has been hanging around our meeting place. He's disturbing our communication with each other. Make him go away. Where is your meeting place? On the hill south of Monterra, there is an old ruined tower there. Let him have it. Yeah. Stop making such a commotion, or the orcs will spot us. What is your mission? I'm looking for a way to get rid of the slave camp guards so that we can help the slaves. But unfortunately, the orcs will raise the alarm as soon as they notice anything suspicious. We don't stand a chance fighting them in the open. There are just too many of them. You rebels are dangerously close to the city. We would take the whole place by storm if we could. But unfortunately, the orcs outnumber us. We probably wouldn't even make it to the temple complex. We already had one of our men infiltrate the orc mercenaries. But somehow, he hasn't achieved much so far. Too many orcs in the slave camp? We can change that. And just how, Mr. Know-it-all? If those slave camp guards come running all at once, we're done for. One would have to pick them off one by one. Who is your spy among the mercenaries? If I tell you that, I might as well give myself up to the orcs right now. First, I would need some proof that I can trust you. I will think of something to lure the slave camp guards away. <laughs> Those orcs are better at using axes than their brains. But they aren't that stupid either. Wait and see. Now this will be worth watching. What's the problem with your spy among the mercenaries? We've done a lot of damage to the city lately. The orcs haven't noticed. But the mercenaries have become more cautious. Therefore, I assume that our spy is lying low so he won't blow his cover. Stop right there, Mora! 
That's the way. Get on with it. Get on with it. You showed him. Hit him. Get home. Yeah. Hit him. That one hit home. Hey, folks. There's a fight. Yeah. Can't you see I'm busy? I need your help with a really big reptile back there. <laughs> you weakling! Where is the beast? A few yards down the... Out of my way. Let a master deal. I'll chop you to pieces. I'll tear you apart. Am I good? Put away your weapon. Once the orc mercenaries notice that we're killing off their guards, they will have our heads, so be careful. <laughs> 